Welcome to part 4 of HTML. In this video, I am going to talk about HTML formatting, quotations and the comments. So as you know already, you can add a paragraph with the help of p tag. So inside paragraph, you can format that particular content. So you can bold with the b tag, you can import and add the text with the help of strong, italic with i and there are a lot of things that you can use. So we will deep dive one by one in the demo part. So this is my VOSCAD editor. Here we can create a file. Let's suppose index.html. And then as you know, like we can create idoctive, the simple HTML format. Then we can have HTML inside HTML. We have two sections head. Then this is a title and this is a body. Here we can define a body and here we can add a title. So this is a tutorial three of HTML. So here I will add some paragraph like welcome to tech ferment. I will save and I will go to the directory of uh, this is my directory here I will open this page so this is a paragraph now I need to format this word uh, this paragraph so I want this content or this text should be in in bold so we can add a b tag so we can use b for define bold purpose so this is a bold also for the strong like important kind of things so we can implement so like we can write another paragraph like html course here we can use a uh, strong as attribute or uh, here we can use strong as a tag save and then reload this page so this is a important and this one is for the bold and second we have italic so we can use uh, italic with the i tag save and then reload so this is an italic kind of content now we have emphasize so like we can add another text now i will add another paragraph let's suppose here we will write hello world save and then reload this page so this is a normal text so now we can use emphasize uh, for emphasizing the content so here save and then reload so this is kind of emphasizing and also we can mark the context so if we want to mark this word so yeah so this would be uh, like highlighted and we have small so you can implement these kind of things uh, one by one so again like let's suppose we have a text and i'm just adding random text i want uh, this particular uh, like small I will add I will close this here and I will save and then reload this page the this part of content uh, is a small and then we have normal text similarly we can delete the uh, the text like delete means uh, the line between the text save and then reload so this is a deleted text or we can add insert a text so we can insert so this is a deleted content and here we can add insert as a tag and i will add like this is new data save and then reload so this is a deleted one and this is new inserted data 
or you can use subscript or superscript like uh, we have a paragraph and I wanted to write H2O like which is a formula of water in a chemistry so I want uh, like like uh, two should be in the bottom so we use SUB as a paragraph subscribe SUB and similarly here save and then reload so this is a H2O subscript and also you can use uh, like x to d power y so you can do that with the help of this so we have x to the power 2 so we use sup so this is how you can format the content and now we have quotations like you can add some quotes so we have black quotes so you can use this tag block quotes inside you can pass some random text or the text so there is a space there is a margin and then you can add some like quotations quotes now like this is for the large text or you can use this tag for the short quotations so you need to use this tag and then this is for the sort uh, my queue is not working so I will use this yep so this is uh, double quotes and then we have this is this one is for the sort quotations and so this is all about uh, like formatting how we can format the content with the help of b tag for the bold strong for important i for italic e em for emphasize mark for highlighting small for small kind of text delete for deleting the content uh, the text like this one or you can answer the data uh, the text uh, with the help of ins and you can subscript or superscript a tag and similarly we can add some quotations like uh, this one so this kind of quotes you can apply for short quotes you can use q tag and in html we can also comment uh, this part so for commenting this part you need to use this kind of symbol so angular bracket we have an angular bracket exclamatory marks and then hyphen hyphen four times and between this part you need to pa pass the comments like I need to comment this one to maybe this one I will save and then I reload this page so this part of content is comment and this is not visible to the user and this comment we use for understanding purpose so this is how you can uh, format the content you can add some codes or you can add some comments so in the next video I will talk about the links how we can implement the links in our web pages and thank you for watching and see you in the next video